Scientific method is an orderly way or logical way of solving problems and discovering new facts. The principles and procedures for the systematic pursuit of knowledge involving the recognition and formulation of a problem, the collection of data through observation and experiment, and the formulation and testing of hypotheses. The scientific method is used in all sciences, including chemistry, physics, geology, and psychology. The scientists in these fields ask different questions and perform different tests. However, they use the same core approach to find answers that are logical and supported by evidence. There are six steps in the scientific method. First, you need to ask a question. The scientific method starts when you ask a question about something that you observe. How, what, when, who, which, why, or where. Then you need to do background research, using library and internet research to help you find the best way to do things and ensure that you don't repeat mistakes from the past. After doing some background research, you have to construct a hypothesis. A hypothesis is an educated guess about how things work. It is an attempt to answer your question with an explanation that can be tested. Then, test your hypothesis by doing an experiment. Your experiment tests whether your prediction is accurate and thus your hypothesis is supported or not. It is important for your experiment to be a fair test. Conduct a fair test by making sure that you change only one factor at a time while keeping all other conditions the same. If your experiment is complete, analyze your data and draw a conclusion. You're going to collect your measurements and analyze them to see if they support your hypothesis or not. Finally, communicate your result. You will communicate your results to others in a final report and on a display board. Scientists are interested in your findings regardless of whether or not they support your original hypothesis. There are three types of hypothesis. These are cause and effect hypothesis, null hypothesis, and alternative hypothesis. Cause and effect hypothesis is a statement that if a certain condition is true, then a supporting observation occurs. Null hypothesis states that there is no significant difference between the results of two conditions being tested. Alternative hypothesis states that there is a significant difference between the results of the two conditions being tested. For example, our problem is finding the effect of water plants to the life of a fish. So our alternative hypothesis, water plants affect the life of a fish. So it is a positively stated hypothesis. Two null hypothesis, water plants does not affect the life of a fish. So the word does not indicates a negatively stated hypothesis. 3. Cause and effect hypothesis. If water plants affect the life of a fish, then water plants will supply enough oxygen for the fish to survive. So it is an if and then statement. If is the cause and then will be the effect. There are three kinds of variables. These are independent variable, dependent variable, and control variable. Independent variable is a factor that can be changed or manipulated by the investigator. Dependent variable is a factor that are dependent on the independent variable. It is also called responding variable. Control variable is a factor that are kept constant throughout the experiment. For example, our problem is finding the effect of kinds of soil to the growth of plants. In our experiment, we will use three setups, A, B, and C. A, for the loom soil, B, clay soil, and in C, sandy soil. These are independent variables because these are the factors that we need to change to test the experiment or problem. The growth of plant is the dependent variable or responding variable because this is the effect of change in the independent variable. The amount of water, same exposure to sunlight, amount of soil, same type and number of plants, 
and same size of container are the control variables. Because these are the factors that needs to be the same all throughout the experiment to get the accurate result.